there is a huge, uh, in fact, a, a scholarly um, uh, volumes uh, being produced about Shakespeare's uh, morality, the morality in his place. But what he did is he managed before Shakespeare uh, English theater, Elizabethan theater was primarily melodrama. There was a villain, there was a good guy, never the twain shall meet. But Shakespeare introduced complexity both into his plots and to his, into his characters that uh, made it much deeper and more riveting for the viewers and introduced, still taught morality uh, through his plays, but in such a way that, that uh, it kept him out of trouble with the government and yet informed and educated the masses. So when we go back to that question I asked you before the break with respect to Shakespeare's perspective, his worldview, and you mentioned that he had possessed a Christian worldview perspective. You just outlined some of the, the different aspects of his work that would be considered to be consistent with a Christian worldview perspective, even though there would be some elements within his plays that would be considered to be offensive oh, to a number absolutely. of Christians. Absolutely. Now, and, you know, in the introduction to the book, The Bard and the Bible, I mentioned that, that there there are parts of uh, his plays that are bawdy, downright offensive to, to many people. But, of course, we don't feature those in the devotions. Um, but page, Glad to hear that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> page by page and reading by reading, I think my hope is that whether a person comes uh, to the Bard in the Bible because they're looking for a devotional or because they love the King James Version or because they are a Christian wanting inspiration or whether they come to it as someone with an interest in Shakespeare or at least willing to learn more about uh, these works of literature. My hope is that both will be not only inspired but also that their lives will be changed and and uh, and because Shakespeare and the Bible put together sometimes I uh, sometimes they agree, the quote and the verse agree, and so I'll, I'll do that. But other times they contrast, and that's informative too. Mm. 